Mustangs fans, Josh Rubin here, joined by Mustangs forward Henry Griffin. Henry, an Oak Park, Illinois native, second season with the Mustangs. Last year, he appeared in 36 games, a goal and three assists, four total points. He got that first goal on the 20th of December at the NA3HL Showcase against Mason City. First off, how did it feel to get that first goal out of the way and kind of just get that monkey off your back? I mean, it was a little later than I would have liked, but it felt awesome, especially because we didn't have the best showcase, and it kind of got that third game off to the right start. And it kind of proves the point, as I always like to say, if you just throw the puck towards the net, good things happen. You entered the zone, just kind of flopped the puck towards the net. It knuckled a little bit, went right in past the goaltender. You obviously played with a little bit of a sigh of relief after that. Then after the showcase, as I was leaving and you were getting on the bus, I said, hey, congrats on the first goal. You were smiling from ear to ear. So you can clearly tell that that first goal is good to get off your shoulders. And early, late, it doesn't matter. It still goes on the score sheet. This season, you've appeared in four games. All four so far, two goals, two assists, four points. You're riding that four-game point streak. First goal came, first game of the season. How'd that feel as wait until December? That felt way better than last year's because, I mean, we were pretty beating St. Louis pretty bad, so it kind of felt good to just get the monkey off the back right away. And as I mentioned, you're a second-year guy. Coming into camp, you kind of know what to expect. You've been through it once before. Does that make things easier or a little bit harder for a second-year player coming in? I would say different because you kind of know all the systems and everything, but you kind of, like, you have more responsibility. You're expected to know all the face-off plays, everything like that, all the systems. And you also got to help the new guys out learning all that stuff. And that kind of segues into my next part of that question. A lot of new faces, a lot of new names in that locker room. As a second-year player, how, how do you help them get adjusted and kind of acclimated to this level of play at junior hockey? I kind of just let them know like, not to like, be shy in the corners, especially block shots, sacrifice the body. Just tell them always work their hardest. Coaches love that. Everyone loves it. And as one of the more seasoned guys coming in, you've seen a lot of the teams in the division. You've played them several times. How does that make your game preparation, game day, different, or is it the same as last year? It's almost the same as last year. The only thing that's different is kind of know what I'm getting. Like, you know, Milwaukee's going to forecheck extremely hard or the bigger teams like Oregon or Wausau. But, you know, just every game's going to be a battle, same as last year. And your second year, what is your expectation of yourself in this second year of junior hockey? I mean, I'd like to produce on the score sheet a lot more, which I already basically have. But I'd like to just win a lot more face-offs and just get a lot, get on the ice a lot more. And kind of going to look at some off-the-cuff hockey stuff here. Off-seasons, obviously, you're training in the off-season, doing stuff like that. But when you're not at the gym, not skating at the rink in the summer, what does Henry Griffin like to do for fun? Um, I like to golf, like to read. I worked a lot this summer. It wasn't, I would say, for fun, but it made me good money, so... <laughs> It's most of my off season. It's always good to have a little cash in your pocket. And hockey sticks aren't cheap, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mustangs fans, that's Henry Griffin. Thanks for your time, Henry. Yeah, thank you, Josh.